Good morning. I am hanging out with Bubba this morning, visiting all the animals and taking a walk around the yard before we start breakfast and before all the other kids are up. Just kind of having some time with Bubba this morning. You had me at a low. Cause where you go is where I go I don't need nobody else I got you And you got me too You can ride all the blue I wanna do what you want to We can leave and run away a quick and easy slow cooker dinner tonight. I had a small package of chicken breast and a small package of chicken thighs so I put both of those in there and then I chopped up a few potatoes and onion and I have a bag of green beans that really needs used up out of the freezer and some Italian dressing. So I'm gonna get everything into the slow cooker, get the Italian dressing poured over the top and let this slow cook for about eight hours and that'll be dinner tonight. Before I forget, if you are new to my channel, please subscribe, stick around, check out some more videos after this one. And if you are coming back to my channel, then thank you guys so much for coming back and watching another video. I try to share something every day, whether it's a grocery haul, a day in the life, a what's for dinner, some homeschooling stuff, some homesteading, gardening, um, just different videos every day so um i hope you guys are enjoying those and i would love to chat with you guys in the comments below if you leave a comment i will get back to you decided to go ahead and get lunch made up and in the fridge so that it is ready when everybody's ready to eat. So I have some mayonnaise, some boiled eggs, three cans of tuna, some um, onion, and some uh, dill pickle relish. I'm just going to get this stirred up, add some salt and pepper, and refrigerate it so that it is ready to go and lunch will be easy today. Today started out so smoothly. I had all these plans of getting everything ready and situated in case storms came. And then um, Penny went out to feed her horse. There was a huge black um, cotton mouth in our shed and it bit her foot. She didn't get bit through her boot though, so she's okay. But it scared us to death and scared her to death. And CJ and I had to go um, get it out of the shed, which it was behind a bunch of stuff. And it was, uh, it was like a half hour adventure trying to get the snake out of the shed and kill it. And... Then James's dad stopped by to make sure everybody was okay and all that because I'd called him and told him about it. And then now there's tornadoes coming all over. And so I've been watching the news, working on tuna sandwiches and just trying to keep up with everything. Anyways, I thought I'd come out and see how much the humidity and stuff has picked up. And uh, now I have a thousand flies flying into my laundry room, but I thought I'd go out and take a little walk. Our first round of storms has already passed through. We've got another round coming in in a few hours. 
but um, kids are just finishing up some inside chores. I came out just to walk around for a little bit before it rains. And uh, yeah, we're gonna watch some movies. Actually, I think the kids are gonna watch movies. I think I'm gonna take a nap and kind of rest because I have a feeling it's gonna be a long night. Mika wanted to make dessert tonight, so she did some shortcakes, blueberry pie filling, chopped up some fresh strawberries, and added some whipped cream to the top. It kind of reminded me of 4th of July, and it was really good and simple, and everybody enjoyed it. Thank you guys for coming along with us today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to check out some more after this one.